Okay, good everyone. This is the Nokak, and we'll be making 50,000 naira every single day. So every day we'll come on this platform, we'll make 50k betting on virtual football. Should use virtual football precisely. Today is going to be different. Today we're going to step it up to 75k daily. I must have been wondering why I don't get to make video, you know, video content often. The fact is, I'm a programmer, and often I'm more focused on my students. So if you don't know me, I'm the Nokak. I teach people how to create softwares, machine learning, um, artificial intelligence, how to program. How to do softwares that can actually be of good benefits. Cryptocurrency softwares, forex softwares, any kind of software that can help you financially. That's the kind of software that I create. Softwares with content. So in case you want to learn anything that has to do with smart softwares, artificial intelligence, machine learning, even hardware programming with Raspberry Pi, you can reach out to me. So without further ado, let's get into it. We started up this journey of making 50,000 naira every single day. We started up with the capital of 2 million. If you remember, that was like 18th of February. So 18th of February, we started up with 2 million, we have been, you know, building top. From 2 million, congratulations, we have been able to get to 562,500 there. So we have made 562k in profit, that's like over 25% if I'm not mistaken. And we're going to be making more because this time around, we're stepping up from 50k daily to 25 to 75,000 there. Now, how we tend to achieve this is not by betting 10 10 k because we've been betting 10 10 10,000 naira like ever since we started. Now, I want us to increase it to like 75, 75, 75. So, um, I see 75, 75, 15, 15. So, instead of playing um, 10 10,000, do I've been playing this time? I'm going to be playing 15, 15,000. So, I don't want to bore you. I'm kind of stressed out. If you don't know what the time is, this is like 12, okay, 11 52 p.m. It's not for 12. This is 11 52 p.m. So, why most of you are asleep? my week and i think i'll be making most of this video recordings at night you have been wondering why i don't have time to do it during the day it's because i get to work often at night during the day especially within the noon i get to rest so every night before 1 p.m or before 1 a.m or 2 a.m check on my youtube channel i'll try as much as possible to drop a video update and also the market is sometimes unstable during the day so when if i want to make a video if the market is not stable I just step out so most times in the afternoon the market is not stable so without um boring you i would you know be betting these games and i'll be explaining what i mean by market stability so the way virtual football works is the basic times or the time frames where you get to bet so there's sometimes you bet there's sometimes you don't bet if you decide to bet every single time you would make pro um, i say profit you would make losses now why is it so let me explain one more now the way virtual football works it, it works in a way that the house always wins so Sporty Bet, Bet Niger, whichever betting platform you use, they created it in a way that it would always win. So this simply means that if you're using Sporty Bet, for instance, uh, you might win today, but it's been structured in a way that in the long term you would lose. So that's just an honest fact. You can't keep winning these people. It's not possible. If anybody tells you they have any strategy, any way you would keep winning every time, all the time, it's not possible. The only thing you need to understand is that time window would let you win. And there are time when they would want you to lose. So whenever they want you to win, which is the time that is suitable for trading, for betting over 1.5, you enter. And whenever they want you to lose, which is the time when over 1.5 will stop failing, you avoid it. And now the fact is, whenever is um, afternoon, that is within the day, over doesn't really come out often. And I can explain why. Now within the day, which is like in the afternoon, lots of people are playing more of over 1.5, over 2.5. You know, people love goals. You're watching a football match, everybody's waiting for when one person will score. So, the normal traditional or cultural love of football is watching people score goals. And our people bring this same love and attitude and mentality and expectations into virtual football. So, during the day, everybody's waiting over 1.5 or 2.5. But 11 p.m., like this, when the average person is sleeping, <laughs> you're guaranteed that you know lots of people are not betting over 1.5. So, any software or anything the software predicts has high possibility of winning so this is why you see me making videos late hours or very early in the morning because at that particular time people are not saturating the market but also you can still make money even on that afternoon so you don't have to wake up at night someone like me I don't wake up at night is is normal for me i code all night till like 11 a.m 12 noon sometimes 1 p.m i code like all night till the next day at noon then i sleep off and i relax but for someone like you you don't have to start forcing yourself to change your clock or to change your whole system into being awake all night so you can play sporty bet. What I would advise you to do is to bet on, on the 1.5. So I was supposed to create a video 
detailing how to bet on 1.5 is almost the same thing as this um oh, it's almost an, uh, i want to make a video detailing how to play on 1.5 it's almost the same thing as playing over the difference between over and under is on under you don't accumulate on over you do so i'm going to hit the previous prediction i'll go to the current season and i would go to graph so you can see if there is profit or loss so looking at this graph right now you can tell you can tell asap that this is a profit right but now one thing i wanted to really understand as well is when you get to change this to 1.5 you get to see the games you won or the games you'd have won now if you look at this graph right now these games that won did not win because the three games played they won because at least one played if i change this graph to table you'll be able to understand better the way on the 1.5 works is one on the 1.5 is up to four odd so let me show you if i head over to spotty bet go to the england league and then go to overstroke under you're going to notice that most times the odds are at least four okay this one is 3.5 for the 1.5 this is four for the 1.5 this is four for the 1.5 so this simply means if i produce three games like the way our software predicts it does produce three games if it predicts three games if one out of the three enters like this one now was 3.6 or that's probably why you're seeing um it's with um 3620 so i guess the odd was maybe 3.62 odd or they are about so playing this 1000 naira gave us 3620 now only one game won just one game won and we're able to get back our money so this simply tells you that if you're playing on the 1.5 you only need one game to win now if i start from the beginning of the season i can tell you a strategy to bet with so the strategy is almost like Martin Gay, but you don't get to accumulate. So let's say if you want to be betting in the afternoon, you don't want to always be at night. You don't want to stay awake at night. Um, if you want to bet on this, all you should simply do is whenever you place a particular game, singles, the next one you do times two. So how? Um, start with a very small amount. So let's say for instance you have uh, one million. Uh, I think one million is small. Okay, maybe the average Nigerian cannot come up with one million. But whoever is betting should actually know that this is professional. Okay, let's just go down to their to their level. Let's say hundred thousand. Now, if you're with a hundred thousand, that the sinner is now useless. Anything I'm telling you now doesn't make sense because the money now comes up small. So let's just go back to one million. Now, if we're betting with one million, we can now start betting each game here with like a thousand naira. Yeah, I know it's too small, but now listen to me. Now we we'll bet a thousand naira here, which is one thousand for this, one thousand for this, and one thousand for this. Or you can just do it 2,000 naira. Now, each time you you win any of these games, you make money. But each time you lose, the next game, you you double up and you start playing times two of everything. So, let's say, for instance, I play 1k here, 1k here, 1k here, and I lost. The next one, I will start playing 2k. So, I will play 2k here, 2k here, 2k here. And guess what? I won because one of these games played. Now, let me show you where the winning comes in. Since this one played, and I played it um 2k. 2k times i think it was 4.4 odd so 2k times 4.4 odd that should be giving us like 8 points um 8.8 right 8.8 .8. okay let's just say 8800 okay 8800 minus the 2k we played here is um 6800 minus the 2k we played here is um 4800 minus the 2k we've been playing this one is like um okay wait, let's come back again we played this game 2000 and it gave us like um, 8,008, right? Because this is 4.4. So, 8,800. 8,800. Remove the capital used in playing it. Now, remember the capital was 2,000 there. So, 2,000, 2,000, 2,000, 6,000. Total game of 6,000 there. If I remove the entire 6,000 I used in playing this game, what happened? I'm left with, I'm left with, um, 2,800. If I remove the 1K, 1K, yeah, I'm left with 800, 1K, okay. I'm not with any profit. So now I understand the calculation I was making. I was actually using for that. So no. Let's use times three. So that way it's more stable. So this simply means if we play 1,000 naira here and we lose 1,000, 1,000. So we have lost three games. So 1,000 naira we have lost. Okay. A new update has come, I guess. This one thing has moved up. Yeah. New update has come. Okay. Back to what we we're saying. Remember, it used to be 3,620, but um, new update, new results have been released okay back to what we're saying so right now if we play um 1000 1000 1000 here yeah, which is one 1000 there if we don't get to win any of them the next one will play times three which is three three thousand there so this simply means 3k 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 now what happens the moment we win any of them 
you know we make profit and recover the losses this strategy is awesome because you get to recover your own money but then it won't really work perfectly fine during the um, during a time like this which is evening this will only pay you like during the afternoon so if i can take this to last two seasons which is like last two seasons if i go to the graph let's go to the graph the graph shows us the better result if i go to the graph now you can see the amount of winnings can you see winning so if we had been playing this thing i uh, remember you play them on 1k each right so if i had been playing this thing last two seasons during the afternoon when everybody was playing over over 2.5 over 1.5 would have been able to make money in fact if you play them on 1000 era without increasing your money like without increasing your stake like you kept playing on 1k out of 114,000, which is 114 predictions because our software give you 114 predictions each particular week it gives you three games each particular will give you three games three games per week in a particular season we have 38 weeks so um three times 38 which means every week three games is giving you 114 so out of 114 predictions 30 entered now because the odds are like you know above three sometimes four each one that won gives you a big amount now the total winnings total winnings that we made throughout that season was 135 but the total amount we bet which is 1k per game was 114,000 now by the time you minus 114,000 from this this is giving you like 21,000 so you can see we made 21,000 in profit 21k in profit if we were betting 1,000 there would have gotten 21k now imagine adding Martin Gay to this particular thing all these games we lost now if we were using Martin Gay as we play 1k yeah we lost 3k we lost 99k we lost the moment we win this one and blood of jesus of zero babel this is two games this is week 14 right so let's go and check week 14 on the graph week 14 week 14 week 14 now you see it's two games played so imagine where you played 1k or 1k you lost 33k you lost 99k you lost then you played 27,000 there so that's 27 sorry no, 9 9, 9, 9 times 3 i think 9 times 3 is yeah 27 27,000. Now imagine you play 27k, 27k, 27k. This one enter for 27k for odd. This one enter for 27k for odd. You should be making at least, you know, make money. You're supposed to make rich 100k. Am I correct? I don't want to make nothing stop. Well, let me confirm. Unless it's my calculator on the computer. So this is you betting with under 1.5. So let's check it very well. Okay, 27,000 there, right? And the odd sometimes is up to 4. So let's say 4 times 4. 108,000. Now, remember now two game enter. So, one, two. I'm seeking pigeon right now because I'm blown. <laughs> okay, times two. Now, this is 216,000 minus. Remember, you played 27k three times. Okay, no, minus all the all the losses you've made. So, the first losses you made was 11k times three. That is 3,000. So, let's say minus 3,000. So, this 3,000 now is this, this first loss we made. 11k times three, 3,000. The second one is um um 33k times 39,000 so let's minus 9,000 minus 9,000 naira you can see 204,000 so we have minus this one we still have 204,000 now this one after i play 3,000 i pay 9,000 9k 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 27 so minus 27,000 minus 27,000 117k 117k now remember this other one this game we play them 27 27 27 that means we play 27k like three times so let's remove all the times we, we bet on it so we'll be able to see that's 27 times three i don't want to make any stupid calculation. i think it's, it's 1000 but let me just confirm 27,000 times three yeah confirm it's 1000 sabi mass die now without mass you can't you can't create anything as a do machine learning okay now minus that it's 1000 minus it's 1000 96k so 96,000 there almost 100k so if you had entered that season if you don't make you see uh, with 1 million there you should be making like 100k in a day if you're betting during the afternoon you understand yeah so i'm really really sorry that i have to go teach you on the 1.5 that's because most people who complain complain i don't do videos every day i mean myself what i do most of 1.5 it's easier to do like just do um play three games you win make your 50k or your 75k I log out, go do other things that it's supposed to. But with one millionaire, one M, you can make as much as. Now, see where the problem is. If you're not bet the wrong hour, wrong hour is towards evening.
so if you just want to know the best time to bet use your normal psychology when will people be coming online to bet over 1.5 because everybody loves the 1.5 so whenever they're playing fat trials it has to be over oh afternoon right or maybe sometime mid in the morning like like at 11 a.m hmm. this kind of time you avoid the market so in, a, in order to even know it easily just go and check the statistics if i go to my sporty bet now and i go to result history if I look at the results history now, I'll be able to know what is playing. Like now, see goals everywhere. Goals posted the day, and at night, nobody they play over. So everything is playing normal. But if I still take this in the afternoon, so can I check? Can I change this into afternoon? Oh, yeah, see afternoon. Move go afternoon. So let's go back to afternoon today. Like this is still 10. No, 10 is today. So let's go to 9th. 9th was yesterday. Okay, 9th. I'm changing this to afternoon and I'm filtering it with the dates. Now watch watch you see say the goals don't they reduce she said don't they reduce right so we have like one two three okay four this is four under 1.5 no four under two one two three four five five under two and i remember these things are 10 so this is like 50 percent went on that two 50 went over two now you check here one two three four okay so it's 40 percent now you go down one three okay this was 12 okay 12 was stable that was stayed in the morning let's change this into afternoon like that kind let's say that kind two three o'clock i know three o'clock people like betting a whole lot of goals okay so one under two under two under two okay let's say one two three four okay four goals there 40 percent one two three four five fifty percent one two three one no let me count one one two three yeah correct now let's go down one two three thirty percent one two three let's go more so whenever you go through the previous results checking out what is currently playing you're going to notice that once you're not beginning to see over uh, what's it called again sorry once you're beginning to see like under 2.5 having anything like 50 percent 60 percent 40 percent you now get to see that a huge cause normally they score goals often so if you just simply start seeing under playing often more and more more and more more and more just at this particular point in time everybody's betting on over because when everybody bets on over the companies they have to do the fast of the results that's really where they get to make profit so that way lots of people get to make losses and then they get to make profits your losses is their gain your gain is their loss so just keep that in mind all the time okay now let's scroll down we have one under 2.5 two three four five six seven six six by two 249 pm and two at uh, 9 pm good okay let's check it again one two three four five six six okay and so i can tell you what happened people like i said the first alarm it goes plenty like people were scoring over and over again and then all of a sudden they started playing on that so that time everybody would not lose their money then they'll start playing over again then people like ah, oh man they don't even know carry atm card before before you start losing but at night it is stable but there's one thing that you would always eat from during the afternoon and that is under but i can teach you how to know when to step out from the under so let's go over to the graph i'm sorry that this is supposed to be okay you know what let's just continue with our betting maybe on a different video i will talk much about this on the 1.5 i'm sorry i had to explain more and more and more i love it when my videos are not just about me betting but it's about educating you as well so if i decide to play right now the videos might get extremely too longer and most people don't even like getting education on what these graphs are but let's just continue so i'm really sorry about the time we stayed and we started um deeply apologize about that i just wanted to make sure i guide everyone properly okay i can see right now that losses are beginning to occur okay three winnings at a streak so if we had played would have had from this let's go back to switch prediction so from switch i can see that both switch prediction and you know normal one is good <laughs> see something that happened there let me show you guys one two three four five six seven seven straight losses seven straight losses so if this was me if i play martin gay martin gay martin gay 
how much in gay again. I will head back and start trying to strategize in order to recover my money. But if the season is quite too late, I usually stay away from it. Okay, so back to normal. Normal seems more stable. I'm gonna be better than normal. The odds of normal are usually too small. So I don't know if we should because the graph for ultra is still perfect, it's nice. Mm, you can see the session it came in war. It came in war. But as last season happens to be very bad. I don't know why the graph is perfect. But the timing is bad. I can see okay if anybody was playing this is them winning one, winning two, winning three. But from here to here, if like the person doesn't know how to manage their losses, they must have blown up their account at this particular point in time. Okay, this is for switch. Let's go for normal. Mm, normal is always a bit thin, but we better switch off because the odds are the same. This particular season had a whole lot of goals. The, go the winning year were excessive. It ended with having a lot of goals. Started the season with still scoring a lot of goals. And then they're trying to, okay, this is normal. So they're still playing well. Let's check switch. I'm really sorry, this chat. So this thing is to help you guys. You know, if I'm not doing all these things in your presence, if I don't get to make all this analysis, analysis before, but if you just see me, you know, make analysis up front, then start recording, you would have issues because you will see me winning all the time. You will know that I make analysis before I win and you just, before I bet, and then you just enter the wrongest period and then you make losses. You will not be more like, ah, why is this guy always winning and I'm losing? And that's because I get to grade up the market, see the chart, know what is happening, which one is favoring, ah, is this one going to put it okay? Like this season, now that it's bad for Ufa. If you go back to under na 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 na, na eh, better bonanza. Yeah, out of 84k, okay, that will be not much profit though. But at least it's 4,960. So this is almost 5k in profit. If anybody was betting under 1.5, yeah, normally you're like 1k per game. The person follow me, five, close to 5,000, 4,960. But if you carry Martin Gay, enter this guy in place, eh, charge, okay. You just call me on your phone and tell me, Mr. Daniel. What do you drink? What's your favorite drink? Like you just made my day. But now you have to study the chart. So you now see the big difference now. So if you just come here without studying the chart, you would obviously just go. So um we could actually tell the software to be giving you this chart often, but I really want it to be you know things people could actually choose to bet on themselves. So I want a situation where like we're doing over 1.5 and on 1.5. Remember that I still over two and under two. And so I love keeping up all the statistics. So that way you'll be able to have a whole lot of knowledge. There are even things you might notice that would be better off that I, don't, I might not even know of. And you'll come back tomorrow and tell me, okay, Mr. Daniel, have you noticed something and something and something and something? But if I don't get to show you how I'm doing all these things, you won't be able to know. So we've crossed him. We started this video 11 p.m. Now 11 p.m. will start. You see that kind of thing now? We we'll don't enter 12 a.m. These are sometimes I see if I, I get tired of making videos because it takes my time. And I should have been coding or doing something by now. So I'm going to just stop this video and call it how to read chat. The, the, okay, I like, I like controversial titles. Um, Renaps under 1.5 virtual football killer strategy plus Martin Gay mass cash out. All right, I'm done. <laughs> okay, so this is what we're going to use. Okay, um, Renaps. Sporty bet on a 1.5 virtual football killer strategy plus Martin G. Mad cash out. And I'll find one in uh, thumbnail that will complement it. Okay, so the next one would just be me betting. I'm really sorry. I, okay, let me first see what I'm betting on. And this is no good. I don't like betting at the end of the season. So if season on the end, it's dangerous. So you don't bet at the end of the season. Note this. When you play at the beginning of the season, you always have chance of recovering your money. When you play at the end of the season, you, you have likely um, no option of recovering your money because every season is like a whole different algorithm. It's like a whole different stance, like a whole different... It's difficult for one season to link to the other season. The second one will have a different. The different is when the company has no balance stock a lot of profit for the previous season so they could take some sentiment which is maybe they've given, given you guys a whole lot of gold and now lots of people won which it sadly happens because the algorithm 
you know, gets the rule of people are playing. That's sorry, that's my mic. That's five, four, three, two, one. The company, the system, they already know already check what everybody play, which one will they play, which one you go fail, which one will you think of king, which one you think of cast. Within that product, that already made that decision. So, um, one season is quite different from the other season. That being said, I'm gonna see you guys on the next episode, which is going to be making 55. My title now will change. It's making 75,000 naira daily. I said 55, 75k daily. Okay, see so you next time. See you all. This is Anukek. Let me stop this video now.